Hello everyone and welcome to Thursday. I have got a fun story that actually just got a lot more enjoyable and I'm really excited to share it with you. So, a few days ago on Twitter, if you follow my Twitter, uh, good, if you don't, bad, you should follow it. Um, I posted that someone stole our doormat, which is very odd. I mean, it's, it's kind of a, it's a college thing to do. It's, in college, a lot of times your doormat will move somewhere else or someone will take it or whatever. It's very stupid and juvenile, but for whatever reason, we uh, we got up one morning, uh, it's probably been almost a week ago, a few days ago, went outside and our doormat was gone. And this was when Mal got up to go to work and I was like, well, I'm, I'm going to go sleep for another hour or two, but when I get up, I'll look for it. So I looked for it because, you know, sometimes if it's really windy or something, you know, if the doormat gets blown away and then, you know, it's not that someone took it, but, you know, it, it it's somewhere on, on the floor. So. I walked the entire apartment complex. I walked the, the place we're at, I walked the floor above, the floor below, um, I walked around outside to see if maybe it had, even though it had not, like the weather had been fine, so it, it didn't make sense that it had blown away. So I was like, holy crap, someone actually stole our doormat. Why would anyone do that? And uh, you know, everyone else's doormats were there, but someone apparently walked by and decided that they wanted ours, and it was gone. And I looked really hard for it, and I just I couldn't find it. So that was a few days ago. Um, today, our doormat has come back to us, which uh, which is really exciting. So I didn't mention it the other day, but now I'm mentioning it today. This is our doormat. It's a little cute wipe your paws doormat because we have key cats. But um, it was it was uh, a little bit ago. I went outside, and our doormat was thrown up against a wall nearby. Like, it was on the floor, it was on our floor, but it wasn't in front of our door. Someone didn't come and put it back on the door. Someone just kind of threw it nearby, but it was our doormat. And I'm like, what the crap? Someone must have felt bad and returned it. And uh, there was people on Twitter saying, you know, well, maybe it got lonely <laughs> and wanted to go see its family. And I'm like, ah, maybe. Um, I'm glad it came back because not having a doormat kind of sucks because you need to wipe your feet. Uh, now for the second part of the story, which is really funny and is all related to filming this vlog. I wanted to talk about the doormat and actually show the doormat, so I just went outside to get the doormat to bring it in. And when I went outside, I opened, I opened the door and I could hear someone coming up the steps. And I was like, oh crap. Because when the, the person knows that my door's open, so it would be rude to close the door and be like, Ugh, I don't want to see anyone. But also, I'm going out to get my doormat and bring it in, which nobody does. So I'm like, I've already committed to this. There's no other thing I could do. I can't like go act like I'm checking the mail because I'm not wearing shoes. So I open the door and I step out and I grab my doormat and the people are coming up. They're like, hey, how are you doing? And I have the doormat in my hand. I'm like, I'm good. Ah! And then I, I creepily go back inside my house. And that's my story. Uh, but at least it's back, so that's good. I've missed you, little doormat, for the, the four or five days you've been gone, so that's nice. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, big news, tonight at midnight, uh, Smash 3DS launches, which is pretty cool. Uh, we're not going to we're not gonna get it at midnight. We are going to get it, though. We're actually going to... I'll talk about it more tomorrow and, and our reasons for wanting to to get the game, but it eventually grew on us. We played the snot out of it and uh, the, the demo, which only is five characters. We just played the crap out of it, and we love it, and we have to get the game. So it's good. It's really freaking good, and I'm excited to play the full version. Anyway, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we? The event is going to take place on October 25th, starting at noon Eastern and going until at least midnight. So we're going to be doing this for at least 12 hours. Uh, this is the third year we've done it. You may recall in the past years we've done Earthbound. Uh, okay, and there's the fire. Oh my god. Everyone pile in! Everyone! <laughs> the one person who's not over here, Justine. Oh my god, this is this is problematic for a few reasons. Um, we're not going to be able to kill the the intended individual. Everyone's just kind of waiting for their turn.